Hello everyone, I am back with another sketchbook tour. August and September, well so far in September have been a little bit crazy. I got married on the first and so it's just been a whirlwind of stuff and traveling. And I'm actually leaving again tomorrow. So I apologize for the lack of uploads the past, I guess, couple weeks now at this point. But I am back, not very healthy right now as I have a head cold. Um, for you newcomers here on this channel, I don't normally sound like this, so I apologize. We are going to start off August with my Moleskin sketchbook. It's the Art Plus, and on here I have some stickers that I got from Minnie Small's uh, zine. Uh, she packaged some of her stickers up whenever you purchased an order, so I thought that that was, <laughs> they're so cute. And I'm probably gonna decorate the rest of this a little bit later. So we start off with my contact page. And we start in with August, so here we go. This is a sketch that I did of a house painting that I was commissioned. And on the same day that I did that, I uh, got different quotes from different books for an art book challenge that I am going to start up. I'm not exactly sure when, um, but it's basically taking a quote from a book that you've never seen before, you just walk in, to a bookstore or you grab a book off your shelf that you haven't read yet, you flip it open to a, a random page, you read that whole page and you pick a sentence out. So that's what this is documenting. This is my first rough draft of that challenge and the actual quote is up here. I'd woken that morning in a foul mood with this, and with a strange buzzing sound in my head. And that's taken from Martha Hall Kelly's Lilac Girls. And so to demonstrate the buzzing sound in the head, I created this bzzz all the way around. I'm not exactly happy with this rough draft, but that's why it's a rough draft. So we will see how that goes. These are just some concepts for watercolor cards that I have started doing. We went to a Nationals and Braves game. The Braves won. Abner is a huge Braves fan, and so I felt like it was important to document that the Braves won. I didn't actually take a picture, so this is from memory. I Please excuse the crude drawing, but I wanted to quickly lay something down. In true me fashion, this is at the terminal as I sit and I wait for my plane. I didn't sit in a very good location, but then I felt really awkward about like sitting down, looking around, and then just getting up and moving again. So I just tried to draw people that I saw while I was there. I wasn't really that into it, which is kind of why they're a little crude, but this one is probably my favorite, and I really enjoyed looking at her tattoo on the back of her neck. From my seat as we're flying. And this, I kind of wanted to paint something that did not have line work over it. I just kind of wanted to see how it would look without the line work. And same thing with the clouds. I was just kind of experimenting with color. Uh, this is from Orange is the New Black, the uh, latest season. This is when uh, Suzanne is flipping through her channels and Red comes up as a clown. So, And then I also watched How to Train Your Dragon. Uh, this is just a crude rough draft of a watercolor card as well, and I did not finish it because we were about ready to land. Some concept drawings, and this is for my paintings that win in Ember's Candle Bar. And this is when it gets a little sketchy. Um, sketchy as in sketchy and sketchy as in bad. <laughs> And yeah, I, I wasn't really feeling a lot of painting and I had to test out painting on our table signs. So I used my sketchbook as the placeholder, like the mat to do so instead of my parents' counters. And we just get really bad here. Um, we ate pizza and a salad. Yes, that's salad. Uh, this is when Abner finally came in to Kansas City and we went to go get our marriage license. Uh, so this is the pamphlet that they had, the receipt is on the back, and then I just crudely drew the front of the courthouse. Uh, Ophelia's is a place in uh, Independence, Missouri, and this is where we went and had our dinner with his parents, grandparents, aunt and sister, and then my parents, sister, and her 
husband. Summit Grill is where we had our kind of kickoff, like the big kickoff with out of town family. A lot of his family is from Puerto Rico and my family is from California, Arizona, etc. And then and then obviously Kansas City. So we all got together and we ate at Summit Grill. And then he and I actually went out after that and met up with friends at McCoy's. And this is the last spread because well, because it's the 31st, <laughs> but we had our rehearsal and then uh, we went to the ball game for our rehearsal dinner and we had it in the draft or craft and draft area of the stadium. And I just wanted to document it. It was just such a fun evening and I just wanted to kind of create stuff that we could remember and pull out these different things. So. We won. Uh, it was a battle of the worst teams between the Kansas City Royals and the Baltimore Orioles. And Kansas City won. <laughs> so yeah, that's that. Uh, and then we start with September. And for the month of September, I'm pretty much going to draw and paint a lot of the things memories and pictures from the wedding. So a lot of the things that our vendors contributed to, like the cake, the wall where my hanbok was was being held, uh, a lot of stuff like that. So I, I promise you September is going to be a lot more interesting than August was. Please, please don't judge me on my August <laughs> sketchbook. But that is all I have for today. Thank you so much for joining me here and I will see you next time. Bye.